Abu, and today I'm giving a speech at my grade school. I just want to go home. <laughs> it's been like more than 15 years since I've been back there. I can't believe I was younger before. <laughs> And I'm super excited to talk about how to start and end the school year right. But first, my coffee! Hello! Oh my gosh, we're here! Check it out. This is the learning tree. Welcome to my grade school alma mater, guys. Oh my gosh, that's just my bus driver when I was young. The guy with yellow sleeves. Oh my gosh, he's still here! Amazing. classroom anymore. This used to be my fourth grade classroom. So <laughs> reminisce, reminisce much. No talking. Hi. So let me introduce you. We were a nice learning to come our alumni. So you can call me Ata Sabu because next I'm much older. I'm a singer-songwriter and I'm also a YouTuber. So I was actually born in the 90s. Uh, do you guys know about the 90s? <laughs> so instead of Google, we actually went to the library to research. Do you guys still go to the library? That's good. Because I remember reading The Chronicles of Narnia by C.S. Lewis. Has anyone heard that? I remember reading that in this library. Wow, it's so nice! This actually used to be my sixth grade classroom. The library didn't used to be this nice. And it's so nice on my paloft. Pa. What? When you guys look at me, you're probably like, hmm, she's from the 90s. She's ancient. But when I look at you, this is what I see. I remember me when I was in grade school. And that's me. <laughs> At grade two, where I started here in Learning Tree. But then I also remember my graduation. Can you imagine? That's all. That all happens like from grade two to graduation. Who's graduating this year? You see grade two and grade six, but you don't see what's happening in the middle. And you know that in the middle sometimes it gets boring, right? But okay, it's your second week. It's just your second week, and I'm sure you've already had days of, I just want to go home. <laughs> because you know, this is how YouTubers talk. So I'm just going to give you guys three tips on how to start and end the year right. Okay? <laughs> Alright, so this is my first tip. The first tip is to just start. You'll be like, oh, I have to be the best to be able to do something like that. Do you feel that sometimes? Or you can see your classmates and say that once oh, she's better than me, she should do it. But when we start, we have to start from where you are right now and who you are right now. Okay, so where are you at right now? Shout your grade. One, two, three. Grade? If you're grade one, can you start in grade two? No, right? You have to start with where you are and who you are right now. If you're six, can you start when you're eight? It'll take a while. You'll have to wait for two years, right? In grade school, I accepted the fact that Filipino is my weakest subject. But I tried, okay? So that's what's important. This year, do you guys promise that you're gonna try? When I was young, I keep saying I can't do it, but I have to try. Good. High five. As a songwriter, my first song hardly made any sense. I was four, <laughs> and all I had was my dream to become Annie. <laughs> you guys want to hear my first song? Yeah! Okay, it doesn't make sense, okay? So don't judge me. <laughs> okay. 
I'm not a boy, not a son, just a girl. <laughs> but that's where I was. I was four. And I tried. And I just did something, right? I was able to create something. Number two is collaborate. Okay, that's a big word. But collaborate basically means to co-labor or work with others. One of my biggest collaborations in grade school actually wasn't with my classmates or my teachers. It was with one of my favorite bands growing up, The Beatles. You guys know the song? I'm so happy you guys know the song. This is the school to study. For my fifth grade investigatory project, I wasn't the best at experiments, okay? But I love physics and Star Trek. Greetings! So I decided to make my first album and that it would it just had to be about the universe. Okay? So I knew all the facts I wanted to put in, but I wasn't really good at making melodies during the band. I got by with a little help from my friends, the Beatles, and a band called Earth, Wind and Fire. By using the melody of some of their songs. I had one track that was original and completely mine, but that was a rap track, so I didn't need to do any melodies. I took a trip to the Milky Way to a planet called Earth where I spent all day. The sensors showed some signs of life, some in harmony, and some in strife. Guess what? They only had two eyes to see, a nose to smell. Could it really be alien perspective of what humans look like? Right? But by applying my first tip, which is just start, and my second tip, which is to collaborate, that year I won Best Investigatory Program. Right? So that's something I didn't because you know normally the things that wither are the things that explode or something like that but this time it was explosive music <laughs> but i would also like to remind everyone that collaboration does not apply during exams okay <laughs> just start on something the second is collaborate and lastly just enjoy guys to give you a gift That's the end of my vlog. Thank you so much for watching. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video. But don't forget that you, you are created to create. <laughs> <laughs> I was an Epia. Yeah.